Utah Constitutional Sovereignty Act. Senate, Senate Bill 57, titled the Utah Constitutional Sovereignty Act, means to create a process by which Utah can respond to federal directives the legislature considers unconstitutional. Senator Scott Sandel, the bill's sponsor, says SB 57 will allow lawmakers to propose a resolution to address questionable federal policy and that once thoroughly vetted and ultimately signed by the governor would direct state agencies not to comply with the federal policy until such a time as when a court ruled for or against it. Once created, the resolution would go through the regular legislative process and ultimately require the signature of the governor should it reach that point. During a House committee hearing held Wednesday, Sandel gave an example of how the process proposed by SB 57 could have recently been used. The ozone transport rule that was recently overturned by the court system. We spent millions of dollars in private industry and we spent countless hours in the state looking to ways we were going to comply with that. At the same time a lawsuit was filed, we, we joined in a lawsuit with other states. Uh, we prevailed, but we spent millions of dollars and hundreds of hours meaninglessly in something that we felt completely that would be overturned. This moves the presumption on those kind of issues, saves the state money, saves our private industry money by saying, we think this is so far out of line with your constitutional right and it infringes upon the state in such a way that we're not going to be complicit until a court would tell us or rule against us. SB 57 passed the Senate before reaching the House Committee and now moves toward the House floor for consideration. To learn more, read the story. This is Maury Kessler reporting for St. George News, your number one source for local news.